Hello and uh, welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy Part 2 um, on Owens Games. I, I think I might just leave it at Owens Games because uh, I can't think of anything <laughs> suitably witty um, or original. Um, they're exactly where we left off. We've just got the first grand star and we're about to get um, another one in here, hopefully. Uh, it's actually been about two weeks since I uploaded that first video though and um, I guess I just want to thank everyone who shared it or who liked it and subscribed to it. I got a lot of good tips um, in the last week or two about what YouTube is looking for or how to how to make your videos look the best. Um, I'm, I'm kind of take, trying to take that to heart. Um, You'll see, even if uh, you look at my last video, that it's changed a little since I first uploaded it. I've added a new thumbnail, which I made with Canva. So, big shout out to Canva. Um, Pedators at work. Um, and also, I've uh, added an intro to it, which I think looks fairly decent, if not particularly original. So. All these things, as far as I'm aware, make a difference to whether your video is going to be sort of boosted by YouTube. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping those things will work. I don't intend to become a uh, millionaire from YouTube. I don't think I'll be buying myself a YouTube-funded mansion anytime soon, but uh, it's fun. It's fun to think that um, there are certain things you can do to, to boost your chances in it. So yeah, here we are again in uh, Good Egg Galaxy. Actually, for the first time, Good Egg, Good Egg Galaxy, but I played through Super Mario Galaxy a few times, so um, I kind of know my way around. Um, I will say I'm having a little uh, difficulty with the um, oops, with the trying to manage the cursor controls as well as Mario. I don't know if that's the most fluid way to do it. Um, accidentally, just before I started recording this, I pressed R and then what I really wanted to do was just change the camera or something, but it actually ended up um, like spitting a bunch of star bits, which are these colored things I'm trying to collect uh, into nothingness, which uh, isn't great. So uh, I'll try to avoid that. I often think it's quite sad that these luminous transform into these portals or these gates. I hope they get the change back. Because that's quite a bait if your sole purpose is to, you know, move Mario to the next orbiting planet. And uh, and there you're done. That's your life. Uh, um, yeah, so what we're doing, trying to do here is collect all five of these. And if we do, then it'll generate another our star right. sort of gave me anyway. Apologies if I am not as good at this game or at any game that I play as I normally would be because uh, I'm trying to balance a uh, few things uh, in one at one, you know, I'm trying to keep an eye on uh, everything that's going on in the game and uh, whoops yeah so it's gonna take some getting used <laughs> I think to be able to uh, negotiate what's going on in the game and talk and just keep an eye on you know like the that the footage is being captured that the audio is being captured uh, it's it's a skill and we even hear YouTubers or game YouTubers who do this for a living that it doesn't come automatically. Uh, sometimes it happens where you have two people uh, working on a video and one will be playing and one will be talking and that's probably a good balance too. If anyone wants to guest star, um, please let me know. Let's get one more here. 
maybe it's also the awkward gravity of Samaria Galaxy, so not only am I trying to manage the audio and video, but uh, you know, the controls are reversed or the left is right and up is down, so it's, uh, yeah, it's uh, maybe it's not the best video to have started out with, but uh, we'll keep going in anyway and see how we get on. At the end of this, we're going to be facing a uh, Dino Piranha, or BT Piranha, and it continues a tradition starting Super Mario Sunshine of uh, the PT Piranha, or some form of a Piranha Plant being the first boss, because in Super Mario Sunshine, the boss at the start of, uh, actually a couple of times in Bianco Hills, is also PT Piranha. So, uh, yeah. I don't think there's any like, anything like that in Super Mario Galaxy though. So or Super Mario Odyssey, so they've changed that. The I'm kind of even though this is a fairly um I suppose simple galaxy compared to some of the others that come across could come up across later because it's you know it's, for the most part it's kind of green fields and it's goombas and it's these things which are effectively Goombas, uh, they die in the same way and they, they look about as threatening. Um, it's a it's kind of one that was showcased before Super Mario Galaxy even came out, you know, it's kind of one of the ones that they showed off. Um, so yeah, it's 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 fun to play it in HD, I would say as well. Um, but, so uh, I can do these first. And then we'll get him to hit himself. Stop punching yourself. Stop punching yourself. Let's see, uh, he looks pretty good in HD, doesn't he? Um, as with most bosses, across most games, not just Nintendo, it's gates that you need to do it three times, and usually that's enough to. Uh, knock him out. I think they knew what they were doing here as well with giving you this kind of boss to start off with because it's the kind of thing whereby you can sort of if you, if you sort of travel across the planet the right way you can kind of come around and come behind or loop around and come back and hit him in the tail so uh you know, it kind of shows off what's on, what's the kind of structure of the game is going to be like. It's going to be running around these uh, these orbs, these planetoids. Okay, maybe we're getting kind of used to the cursor. Maybe we're not actually uh, going to have too much trouble here. I wonder what that plant is. It's kind of glowy. Um, now we have Power Star number two added to our collection. And then, I'm actually quite impressed. Uh, last time I, uh, I uploaded this video, or I uploaded my last video, and it's another thing I would say is that it's hard to watch your own videos. Uh, it's like just listening to yourself being recorded. Um, well, on top of that, you also have, if you're making mistakes and you're kind of saying, oh, my God, oh, my God, I couldn't, I didn't need to do that. Um, so, uh, yeah, you're kind of conscious of things that uh, you did wrong, as well as the fact that you're listening, you're, as well as the fact you're listening to your own voice and nobody likes listening to their own voice, uh, recorded anyway. Um, but yeah, something else I noticed with when I was doing it is that there is an episode there, the part where um, Mario is like waking up from sort of um, being unconscious, I suppose. He did get blasted into space and uh, the loom is around him and um, he kind of makes this oh! kind of sound. And uh, if you look back at the video, it's actually kind of hard to tell which was, <laughs> which is like, oh! Is coming from the um, the video or from me, so I was quite 
happy there to be making a little uh, cameo as Mario. So yeah, uh, we're starting off with Super Mario Galaxy, as you can see, and as you know by now. Um, but I'd love to hear your thoughts on uh, your parts of the game, if you've played it, or do you think it looks good? Um, are there any other games that you'd like me to play? Because if I keep this up for a long time, then I obviously want to have other things to, to play. I want to, I'd love to do a Pokemon game, I'd love to do... Uh, a Zelda game, I'd love to do, um, you know, even something short like Star Fox or something uh, that would be fun to do. Um, but yeah, or, or something like kind of quite epic like uh, Shadow of the Glasses, which is also quite short, but uh, if you haven't played it, you can watch a Let's Play of it and actually get quite a lot from it, so um, that's an option. So yeah, one thing you can do is if you can't beat an enemy is that you can shoot these star bits at them, like that, and uh, that'll kind of stun them. But you don't need to do that just yet. Um, for this particular mission, what we want to do is... We're in the right place, no we're not. Well, we need to feed this Luma, this hungry Luma, um, a certain number of star bits, I have to collect a few. I forget how much he needs. Might be about 100 maybe? Might be less at the same stage of the game. But, uh, yeah. Just have to kind of be careful that I don't take different paths if that's possible. Oh yeah, okay, perfect. So yeah, we'll go up here and see if we can help him out. And then we can use these pull stars to um, get us there. Again, this is something that's changed a little from the Wii version, where it was really a case of pointing at the screen, and uh, then you could be the direction of where you wanted to go. But uh, here, it's a little bit more, um, a little bit more, uh, a little less motion controls. Uh, it works, I suppose. Um, Hopefully we have enough for this fella. Um, I don't know if it's the case that we can go back either, so if we don't have enough, we have to start again. It's always the fear, isn't it? No matter what game you're playing, well, I have to start again. Um, though it's a lot different in, in 2022 saying that because, uh, you know, that start again in the 1980s, like, God help you, but in 2022 you'll probably only put back a screen or two, so uh, not too bad at all. We see how much this guy needs. Wherever he is. Where has he gone? Where is he? Should I have used that? Um, should I have shaken my uh, controller to get to there? Or was that is this actually the right place to go? I forget now, so we'll just have to go for it and see what happens. Look at the case that we're going around in a circle, actually. Oh no, here he is. Let's hope we have enough now. 90? 91? Good haggle with this hungry fella and he wants 100, oh so we're close um, there should be enough here just stop from this guy and maybe find another few patches oh yeah perfect we'll break this and now we have a one up or a one man what do you want to call it and uh, we can feed this fella yeah, so that's him fed. Um, off he goes and transforms again into a planet. Perfect. 
so I'm only gonna use this card as a star. Again, I don't know what happened to him. If he's he was a hungry little mug, but now he's a planet and that's his life, I guess. I don't think he's going back. Um so yeah. Godspeed. Um we won't think about the lives that'll be lost in getting Mario to his next um, set of cardboard boxes. I think this one now is just a case of um, getting up to the top. Again, we're not used to contro the controls. It's kind of like, how do I do this again? Oh yeah, there we go. Grand. Oops. Fine. Another kind of um, change, I suppose, they made with this compared to Sunshine or. Uh, is that they um, made it so that you only have three? Oh, um, you only have three different uh, parts of your health bar, and if they're gone, like there's not really much you can do. Um, there are sometimes there are a few times before bosses where you'll get six, um, but uh, you know most part is three, so it makes it kind of a little bit more challenging, I suppose. Coins are in abundance, though, so not too, too bad. All oh, right, the star actually takes a bit longer than I thought to get. And I'm, so excuse me, it's a slightly longer video. Wait, here we go. Up in here, and now we see the first of Super Mario Galaxy's. Um, Gravity bending challenges. For this playthrough, though, I think if we come across stars that are too hard, I'm just going to skip them because nobody wants to see me fail. Well, maybe there are a couple people out there who want to see me fail, and uh, um, yeah, this channel isn't for you. I fear out there <laughs> looking to see me, looking to see me get my. Um, get me defeated in battle and get me, see me lose all my lives um, just generally land in my face um, it wasn't for you it wouldn't be a success and one more here so stars in the middle but in order to kind of get a pull towards it I have to collect these blue uh, shards. Again, you can see it's sort of how Super Mario Galaxy sort of plays with our expectations. You know, we're used to being on platforms whereby if we fall, if we jump off here, then we're dead. But uh, instead, you can walk underneath it, and there's more stuff to do. So, um, oops, I'm getting oops. <laughs> The controls are going to mess up my head a little bit now. Just, oops, just walk along here. I'm going to go over here then and go upside down. Um, so yeah, uh, if you if you want to hear more about Super Mario Galaxy, if you want to more factoids, more fun points, um, then let me know and uh, I'll keep doing these. Uh, I intend to keep doing them anyway, I suppose, but just uh, let me know how you're finding them. And there we have our third power star. So thanks very much for watching again. Uh, if you're subscribed to the channel, you'll have gotten notified about this, so please give it a like or a share or subscribe and, or a comment even. And uh, just let me know how you're getting on. Um, I'm open to, to suggestions and uh, feedback. Um, particularly in regards to the sound, which I still think is maybe not 100%. I'll see you next time.